Ralph, your reaction to uh, to breaking the record and getting it back under the Dodge Fold? Well, our engineers thought it could be done. They, there was no um, concern. It was more how much, how how much would we break it? We came here pretty humble, you know, not um, expecting much. But the car is amazing. Uh, Chris thinks there's actually more in it. Yeah, we broke the record by over a second easily, uh, and he thinks there's more. So he's going to keep going today <laughs> and see what it can do. But uh, to me, it validates what the car is all about. The ACR is really, really a serious piece of machinery, and, and I think it, it, this really underscores the car's um, uh, affinity for the track. This is one of the tracks that the car is built for. It's, um, uh, you know, it's, it's basically a mini Nürburgring. Um, it's got blind corners, huge changes in elevation. Uh, it's perfect track for the car. What about the uh, the personal thrill of, of breaking the record on this? It, it's an honor. It's an incredible honor. Um, you know, I'm, I'm glad that they, you know, didn't just hire a professional and, um, you know, went to one of the guys that actually developed the car. You know, Ralph and all the guys at SRT, I'm just thankful that they gave me the opportunity. What What did you do to the car to make it possible to break this record today? Um, we took it off the assembly line, put it in a transporter, and brought it to Laguna. Uh, basically, very little. Um, we, we dropped the ride height, uh, we turned the knobs to their suggested setting, and um, that was it. The, the car is fantastic, and there's, there's still more in it, for sure.